Happy Father's Day. What is real and what is fake? That's the question today. We have a fake officer, fake plants, a fake festival, a fake permit, and some fake eyelashes. The eyelashes don't matter, but enforcing a non-existent permit is fake. Finally, the LAPD lapdogs were also there. That and so much more happened last week on L. Ron Hubbard Way. Let's jump into it. Kelly sees an officer in the distance and calls him to talk to him. This officer seems shy. He doesn't want to come closer to talk to Kelly. Or does he have another reason for not going to her? Excuse me. Hello. Oh, there they are. There's security and a cop. Excuse me. Oh, hi. Can you, can I, I can't cross this, can I? Do you have your event still going on? I was told by the security fella. This guy has been showing up everywhere lately and seems to be giving orders to the others. Is this an OCC org member? Uh, say again? Thank you. I know you've been clear I'm not welcome, but what I'm asking and also, are you able to come closer so I don't have to scream over the music? You're not allowed to come closer? The cop is. Are you a real police officer? Kelly asks him directly if he's an officer and he doesn't deny it. Why am I bringing this up? That will become clear later. You're off duty, so you have to do what they tell you? You can't come over and talk to me? Oh, the reason is he's off duty. That implies he's an officer, right? But why doesn't he want to talk to Kelly? I, it's me, I struggle to hear, but um, yeah, I am screaming. That's okay, that's okay. Can you show me the permit? Because I was told repeatedly that this would end yesterday. The permit for the alleged children's festival expired on June 9th, and today is June 10th. And I can't find the permit online, so I'm just asking to see the permit. You... Say again? Oh, your management or theirs? Oh, he knows it. He can help. You're, can you send? Oh, this isn't the line. It's back here. Oh. But then I really can't talk to you or see you because you'll be behind a curtain. Can you send the bearded one over? I think. Really, you promise? You promise you'll come talk to me? You give me your word? You're only as good as your word. You probably guessed it. The officer won't be coming to talk to Kelly. Lara came by to bring the protester energy and music. Henry had explained to Kelly that Bluetooth is a weak point and can be used to gain access to the phone. Then Kelly, you guys can charge. Yours is charging thank at you. my spot. Thank you, thank and you. And this is a whole battery bank. And this is a little speaker if you guys want to play music. Thank you. Do you have another phone to play music or anything? I have an Henry no, that's going to be one. very oh, upset. Can we will. use a cord? Henry, who's going to be very upset with their music? No, with Bluetooth. <laughs> oh, that's is it, Can hilarious. I use a cord? Yeah, I think see? so. I, we'll try a it. C, oh. do a C. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, my God. It's okay. We can use cords. Henry knows. Safe. No, Henry knows. That's so funny. Okay, well, I usually the... don't do Bluetooth with my stuff, but yeah, I've always, I never, yeah, it's good to have them on board okay, with that. We'll uh, I feel like thinking things. I always feel like somebody's watching me because they are. Because they are for real. <laughs> uh, the next day, Kelly encountered the officer again, and this time he went to her with a piece of paper that was supposed to be the new permit. Hi. Here's the guy again. Osa, probably. I, I'm okay. Like you, uh, like you requested, uh, this is a street closure permit. That's from the 610 to 616 until midnight or 11 p.m. And it's uh, for this street between uh, Harvard and Sunset, which includes, includes the sidewalk. The permit says the closure when granted will be there for the exclusion of vehicle only. The public at large may not be denied access to any portion of any street except in case of emergency. Exclusion of vehicle only. There is no exclusion of people on the sidewalk. He is lying if he says otherwise. Hold it steady, would you? All right, so on 6-7, the permit, I'll turn applicant name. I get that might be erased. Okay, okay. All right, so Veterans Health and Resource 
is happening. No, no, no. This is the kids zone and it's with the uh, Latino Immigrant Democrat Council. One moment. Keep going. So that's not accurate. Right, let'll take the picture. With now the OSA guy interferes and puts pressure on Kelly to take a photo. Right, let'll take the picture. We're done here. Yeah. That's it. Kelly still assumes she's talking to an LAPD officer. I know you're torn in the... So yeah, you're in the middle. I get it, but you, you and gotcha. I both know this so, is not so accurate. Just, Wait a minute. I'm sorry. Hold up. Yeah. Are you taking a picture or not? Closure. It's probably easy of the just to street take a... and the side. Okay, so sidewalk yeah. closure. It just, sir. I have learning take, differences, take, take and I picture. need you to simmer so I can read. I know, but take no, I didn't we'll say that. I never said that. Okay, let's go. He, so uh, just so you know, sir, you already let him talk to you that way. They want. They want me back over there. So just so you know, it is. That's not okay how he just talked to you. You have to take up with the church, ma'am. So, the, the, he works with the church. So, it includes the, sidewalk, includes the sidewalk here. So, it's basically like... I'm struck. I'm not private bullshitting event. you. So, I have learning differences. Can yeah. I slow... I couldn't read with him hovering on my backside either. Don't come up on someone's backside. It's I'm still, really not. It's still part of the permanent area. All right. They don't want you here. So, if you want to hang out at the corner... No, I don't totally want to cool. hang out on that corner. Um... But, but just so can you, know, you explain to me what the Veterans Health Resource Expo is when this is for the Latino part, Immigrant Democratic sure Club and the kids? To, uh, Scientology you, management. All right, but, Burke. So I'm just passing on. The Let's take a look at the uniform. It's black with a name tag. Burke, a holster, a gun, badge. Looks like an officer at first glance, and I think that's intentional. Part of the permanent zone. All right. Um, if you fail, to, if you continue to yeah, stay here. Yeah, I know. The, I know. They end up getting works. arrested for Yeah, in Tiendo, in Tiendo. Okay. Now, fake officer Burke is talking about arrest for trespassing, but he has no authority, nor does the piece of paper say that no one is allowed to go through. This, I can't find that online, so I already don't trust what this is. A piece of paper somebody could have yeah. printed in Word or something. So you're two one three. Yeah. And then Burke. Okay, and also I want to say this. I know you know this. You know we're out there with people yeah. that escape this place from being born into it as children who experience atrocious, severe child abuse. I know you know that. Their response to us educating people on the child abuse is to have a kids' zone fun fest. That's what you're getting paid to protect. He's obviously not interested in hearing more from Kelly and just wants to get away quickly. I'm sorry. I know times are rough and we need money, but at some point a line's got to be drawn. And that guy talked to you like a fucking douchebag. Watch. Look at him. He's coming over here. Watch. He already saw me. He's, he's making his way over here. Can I see the new, 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 the new permit? I'm going through. I'm going through. I'm going through, officer. Officer, do you, do you have the new permit? Aja also thinks this is an LAPD officer. She mentions it to him several times and he doesn't even correct her. No, can you come and talk to me, please? I, I, I didn't ask you if you were interested. I You're working for me, right? I'm the public, right? So I got have a question for you. I'm the one that pays you, not Scientology. And here's the OSA guy again, giving instructions. Well, well, can you be polite and come talk to me like a, like a regular citizen that I am? I know, but that's very rude of you want to talk to me. From, I'm screaming over here so you can hear me. Yeah, but... Can you please come closer? Okay, all right, but everyone else is walking here and no one, they don't tell him anything. But if you see someone with a phone, they, they tell you that street is closed. That's not, that's not freedom, right? If it's like I'm in North Korea or, or, or like I mean, in a third world country, look at people walking by, they, I, I've been watching, they don't, they don't say nothing to them. But if it's me, a member of the public, another citizen, just because I have a phone in my hand, they tell me the street is closed, but they don't say it to everybody else. So do I, am I still in America? Is California still America? Like, it doesn't feel like I have freedom. Okay, but what I'm trying to get you to understand, everyone else without a phone in their hands can freely walk up and down the street. So, why is it that my freedom is being infringed? 
Why am I paying taxes if I'm not allowed to walk freely in the streets of my city, Hollywood? This is my city. Don't go in there. They're going to try to take your kids. They're going to, Scientology will try to take your kids. Don't go. They're going to try to take your kids. It's a cult. Es una secta. Scientology is a secta. Es una secta. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Thank you. No. Why is he telling you what to say? I don't have to abide by what they say. I want to see. I want to. I want you to show me. It should be on record with the. Hold on a second. Okay. Thank you very much. Right. Appreciate it. What is your Burke? How do you say Burke? What is your serial number, Burke? Two one three, that's just just those three numbers. Two one three. All right. Well, I wanna I wanna look it up. See. Once again, he has asked for his serial number and gives two hundred thirteen. This is not an LAPD serial number, and Aja knows that. However, she assumes that he doesn't want to identify himself and is therefore lying. He also gives the name Burke, and there is an officer Burke in the Hollywood division. Two one three. That's my. Mm. This is the area code from here, from from LA. 213. He gave me 213 area code. Can you, uh, Bert, B U R K E, I think is it? And that man, Scientology over there telling him, telling him behind his, behind his back, telling him what to say. Well, at least the family didn't go in, so I got two birds with one stone. Aja goes back again because she knows that this is not an LAPD serial number. But then the fake officer tells her that she's on a list. Yep, Scientology thinks they can make a list of names that are banned from using the road and this moron goes along with it. Officer! Where's the officer at? He gave me that, he gave me the wrong serial number. Your serial number is 36665, right? I read, I read the permit and it says it's only for vehicles only, not for pedestrians. No, but this is a, this is not a hard closure. It says for vehicles only. So why didn't you tell that lady that's walking by that it's closed? They have, wait, 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 say that again. But I have never been trespassed from this, from this area. I have never been trespassed. So how, how do you have a list of certain names that they do not want here? What is your actual serial number? Give me that real one. Okay, well, I'm going to file a complaint about you. I'm going to file a complaint report about you because you gave me, you gave me a fake serial number. I'm going to give you a chance to redeem yourself. What is your serial number? No, I want serial number. I am a member of the public. You're supposed to give it to me. You, if... I, Excuse me? No, you have not. What is your actual serial number? So you're going to refuse to identify. You're going to... Again, you're refusing to identify. Okay, Christopher Burke, I'm going to file a complaint on you for not identifying properly to the member of the public when I'm asking you to identify. She said she would, and she did. Aja went to the police station and wanted to file a complaint for Officer Burke. Aja showed the video to the sergeant. The sergeant quickly realized with his trained eye that this was not an LAPD officer. The name tag is in the wrong place. The badge doesn't look right. But most importantly, he has a patch on his upper arm like a security guard. Is this guy from outside security or Scientology? I don't know. It's strange that there are no LAPD lapdogs to watch out for Scientology. So he's, imper he's impersonating a police officer. Well, no, not necessarily. It depends on what his, his patches are. His patches say security, but so if you notice, like, in my uniform, we have yes. a but I don't, You're right. I don't have a city patch. So that right there kind of doesn't look like a, an actual Los Angeles police officer. Okay, first of all, I'm going to He claimed to be an LAPD officer. In any case, he never corrected it when he was addressed like that. 
and he claimed to Kelly that he was off duty. So watch out, protesters. They're trying to trick you. See where his name tag is at? Yeah. He's wearing his name tag above the shirt pocket. Mm -hmm. Ours is on the shirt pocket. I think this is private security for Scientology. Mm -hmm. For Scientology? Yeah. Well, he, he, he really does. He looks like a cop. He <laughs> said he was LAPD, so he's impersonating you guys. He, did, he actually did tell you that? or When I asked him, yeah. Another security guard tries to chase Chris and Aja away. This time, they were clever enough to sit on the wall of Kaiser's. They are not on the sidewalk and are not on Scientology grounds. Bad luck security. Just, just don't talk. Just ready. don't talk. I'm not going to really say shit. Yeah. I'm not, we're we're going to be quiet. No, I'm not. Aja knows who the bad actors are. I do know. That are trying to cancel her. I asked yeah. her to keep it closed. Aja, senior content. What? Hey, so... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Start fresh from the beginning. What did you say to me? So I'm saying... This is a permitted event. Okay, no, that's not what I asked you, so I'm going to stop you right there. What and did you say? You cannot be here. You're not welcome. Well, thank, I'm, on the, thank I'm you. a Kaiser member. I'm a Kaiser so, Permanente member, and I'm on Kaiser Wall, so... What are you trying to say right now, sir? You cannot be here. So I'm on the, you're not... I'm the, we're not on Scientology. Look, we're not on Scientology. We're not, we're not on the property, our, though. We don't even have our feet, our feet on the sidewalk. Okay. We're flying. Look where we at. We're, I'm sitting on Kaiser Permanente, and I'm a member of Kaiser. I have a, I'm, a, I'm a member of Kaiser, so you cannot tell me not to be in Kaiser Permanente uh, 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 establishment. I'm a member of Kaiser. I'm not even on Scientology. You want to have a conversation? I, I, I didn't ask for a conversation. You came over here to us. <laughs> I, we, we were having a conversation, me and him. You injected yourself okay. in our conversation. So for you told. to say, for you to say Thank that you. we're having a conversation with you, that's, I don't want a conversation with you. You could even see... That's the walk of shame, the walk of shame, the, the walk of shame. He said he liked your content, though. Yeah. By the way, put a bra on. <laughs> your tatas are hanging too low. The, the thing is, the sidewalk is, like, linear, so you could see where the freaking sidewalk is. Look at this. He said he, watched my, he watches my content, and he loves my content. You don't watch me? I feel left out. And here is another fake. How can I pretend to beautify my neighborhood? Choose large wooden boxes that are made of quality wood and look nice. This will blend into the landscape and look natural. Large, beautiful, green, healthy plants complete the picture and make it special. Plastic. They're plastic. Look at so Look, <laughs> they're plastic. Pla look at this plant. Like the, like the fake plants over there. Like the fake plants DOS posing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it goes well together. It goes well. It goes so, well together. Look at this one. Trying it out, like, to see how it looks. Huh? I mean, only two. I'm look. guessing they're like gonna buy more, right? I, I guess they're. Who who did this? This is look at this. It's Scientology, you know. Well, obviously, because why is this here? It's still here. If it wasn't Scientology, they were they already throw it out. Unless it looked good. But who's they trying to fool? Uh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Are, are Scientology, be, Scientology being messy? They're trying to send a message about fake plants. <laughs> Scientology is sending a message. They, they're saying they got two fake plants. There are two fake plants. Scientology, you're crafty, Scientology. You are messy, Scientology. What are you trying to tell us, huh? They're calling us plants. Chris, Chris. Chris. I Chris, I do, is this you? Do you identify as this? <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> there you go. We already got two fake plans. Stay right there. I'll stand right here. This is my mom. This is mine. This is mine right here. Chris, no. Chris, look at Chris, the fake plan. There's Chris. Ah! Look at that big old plant. Look at this plant. Look at it. They got a fake plant right here. We got a real plant over here. We got a fake plant over here and a real plant. <laughs> you did not. A particular advantage of these large boxes is that the passenger is always protected by the planters as no one can spontaneously open the passenger door. This is good for safety. Which proves our theory, okay, mine, this is definitely somebody's uh, Scientology car that's literally just here to uh, keep people from parking. Actually, who's paying for their parking? 
the planters black yeah look at this look at this if look at this person this person will hit that if they want to come out they will hit it see look at this look at city look city look city that person will not be able to get out see that the fire department will also be very pleased that these planters are there as they won't have to try to drive right up to the building in the event of a fire in the fire lane yeah that's right the fire lane which also just another lovely reminder they blocked off the entire fire lane there if you don't have enough planters you have to get creative the lawn can easily be covered with a pretty green net to do this take a few wooden stakes hammer them into the ground and stretch a net over them some would say that's art alternatively you can embellish the boxes with a few sad withered plants or with a few virtual palms. Whatever you choose, it looks great. Is there another way to beautify the sidewalk if I don't have enough boxes? Oh yes, there is another way to beautify the sidewalk. Take large bags of sand and stones and line them up like a string of pearls on the sidewalk easements, close together so that no one can accidentally slip between the bags. It must create a uniform overall picture. If you then have a team that keeps everything clean, of course, with a supervisor who monitors everything, then you've made it. Now you know how to fake your neighborhood beautification. We are here for you. It's never too late, folks. You're all loved by many. We love you. We can help you leave Scientology when you're ready to leave. Just know that. You guys are loved by many. Nothing against you guys personally. Just know we are here for you. Oh no, good morning. How are you? Can I at least shake your hand? No, sir, have a beautiful day, all right, my man? You're loved by many, my friend. No, we are here for you, and we'll always be here for you. On Friday, we there was an encounter with a female security guard. She was loud, aggressive, presumptuous, intrusive, and of course, armed. Whatever she is carrying in her holster, you can only see the handle. I'll say right up front, this person has no authority, power, or legal basis to stop Jess, Tori, Solomon, or anyone else from walking down a street. Just because she's paid to do it and told what to do doesn't mean she's allowed to behave that way. The permit clearly says only vehicles are excluded. By the way, I haven't seen any paid LAPD lapdogs all week. Uh, don't touch her. Don't touch her. Do not touch her. I'm not touching her. She's walking into me. Okay, so yeah. show her the permit. Turn around. Turn around. No. Who does she thinks she is? Do not touch her. No, she. I'm not touching her. I have to new move back. What is she doing? To get behind. Okay. Do not push her. Oh my God! What is wrong with this lady? Show her the permit then. That's assault. Okay, go get the cops. Get the cops. Where's the cops? Where's the cops? Get the cops. 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 Oh my! So get the cops. Get the cops. She just. Okay. Yes, she was touching the phone and she was getting louder. Luckily, Tori has a firm grip on her phone, otherwise it would have fallen. What does the security think she's doing? I replay the whole thing again slowly. Oh you my! You will be arrested for trespassing. So get the cops! Get the cops! She just. Okay. What? Do not touch her phone. What is wrong with this lady? So call the cops. Call the cops. You call the cops. Get off your phone. Why would I call the cops? Why would you not call the cops? You're the one threatening him. You said you're going to arrest someone. This lady's nuts. Are you a cop? This lady is nuts. This lady is actually nuts. Are you a cop? Are you a cop? You said we were getting arrested. Where's the cops? She wants to arrest Tori for trespassing without a permit, without authorization, and she doesn't want to call the LAPD either. Damn, she's so stupid. She's nuts. She's nuts. You don't own the street, dude. I know. I saw her. It's literally on camera. I can throw you on the block. I can throw you on the block. I can throw you on the block. You're, oh my. I'm telling you, you cannot. Call the cops. 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 
I know I'm repeating myself, but the permit only applies to vehicles, not pedestrians. Can someone please call the department responsible for this permit and tell them what Scientology does? Show the permits! Okay, there's a permit we can't check online. Show us here. Yeah. No, thank you. No, thank you. That's your job. Call the cops. You said you were going to have us arrested. You said you were going to have us arrested. Let's go. Where's the cops? We got the rent a cop here saying that she's a. Uh, She's in person. Call the cops. You have a you have a phone. No, I'm not. Look it up. You're committing Look some it up. Come on. <laughs> Closures for vehicles only. Closures for vehicles only. Why don't you go home, man? Closures for vehicles only. Closures for vehicles only. Okay. She has nothing to say now. <laughs> Can you get a we saw it! Closure for vehicles only! It literally said the permit says that. Come on, call the cops, please. Oh my god. She's not a vehicle. I saw it! I saw it! She is not a vehicle. Can you call the cops? If, if you're gonna complain, call the cops. I'm through before you open your mouth. Okay, I need you to back up. Do not touch me. Okay, back up. Do not touch me. I need you to go behind. Do not touch me. Okay. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. I'm not touching you. No, you actually are. You are trespassing. I've already told you multiple times. I need you to step back. You can stand right there, ma'am. That's no problem. But you cannot be right here. You're in a permitted area. Okay. No, thank you. I need you to step back. Stop touching me, you freaking creep. Bro, this lady is nuts. Yeah. Hey! 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 Permitted area. Permitted area, please. Fucking assaulted me. She just grabbed my hand like that. That was very normal. She definitely doesn't know the law. She can't just grab Solomon's bike and push the bike and him away. It's just unbelievable what this woman is doing. If the situation were reversed, Solomon would already have handcuffs on his wrist. Closure says for vehicles. Can we see the permit? Can we see the permit? Well, you can't because it doesn't say for humans and they know that. She has the permit. You're not welcome here. Then tell her to show it. Show it. No, you. You're in a permitted Call the cops. So call the cops. Yes, I did. It is permitted for vehicles. For vehicles. I'm not a vehicle. I'm not a vehicle. Does she get $47 a week, though? Oh my God, look at this lady. She is so bizarre. No, no, I, she, she would. She probably will too. She has no self-control. Have a good one. Do not touch him. Do not. Do not touch him! Call the cops! Call the cops! Call the cops! This woman is absolutely nuts and aggressive. I bet she would have gotten violent if the cameras weren't there. It seems like Scientology has outsourced the aggressive behavior to outside security. Hi, I'm on L. Ron Hubbard Way in Fountain Ave, and there is somebody here um, that's refusing to let us walk down the street, but refuses to show a permit and the permit that she's claiming that there is, we have not found. And when we tried to walk through, she pushed an elderly lady and a child. Um, we, yeah. All right, I called. Don't worry, I called for you, lady. Miss rent a cop What a surprise. The LAPD hasn't shown up yet. Crazy security touched Tori and Solomon, which could lead to a private person arrest. Well, we know the LAPD and how they feel about it. You gotta at least warn the people when they walk out, not to say they're not Scientologists, at least. If you like the video, click the like button and subscribe to the channel. Is Odo over there picking what religions can walk through? Odo's just guarding it, letting, asking for a religion check as they walk through? Hi, I called about an hour ago um, for a, it was on Fountain Ave and L. Ron Hubbard Way regarding us not being allowed to walk down the street. Nobody ever came. It was about an hour ago. We asked for a permit. They refused to show one. And then they 
proceeded to the woman here to push a minor and an elderly woman um, while we're watching everybody go down the street, but they are refusing to allow us. Yes, I called like an hour ago and nobody Monica. came. Monica. Yes, the, uh, we have watched as everybody walked up and down the street and this woman threatened to taser a minor if we walked down for some reason. Hey, Monica, why did you choose to Streets is there and he's going to show the security guards what he thinks of the fake permit they're supposed to be following. Now you guys ready to walk through? I'm ready to walk through. Yeah, I'm, I'm hella ready. I saw that permit. That permit does not deny it. You are Look, here comes the linebacker. Phone. You have no idea what you're doing. You're not denying Look. the permit. The permit says otherwise. What you are doing is you are impeding my privacy. I'm impeding my privacy. Don't impede my. It's not a private event. That's not what this thing says. You guys, you guys. This lady is literally psychotic. Yeah. They, okay, good. Good. Well, we just read you the permit. We just read the permit. You are faking. The police, correct? Do you have a permit? Yes, you're not, you're not the police. Kidding? I'm gonna find a way through this shit. Yeah, you're out of your mind. You guys are not going to impede the progress of the public. The public, we are allowed to walk through. I'm walking through. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. Walk through over there. You're allowed to walk through. Go ahead. It's not a permit event. That's not what it says. No, I'm not. I just read the permit. I'm walking through. I just read the permit. I'm walking through. Do not stop me. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. You will stop be touching for me. Wait, how, who, are you gonna arrest me? Are you gonna arrest me? Stop touching me. Stop You're touching right. me. The permit does not say that. The permit says otherwise. Get the police here. You are not allowed to impede the Prague Republic. I'm a member of the public. Okay. Oh, you bluffed. You do that bluffing for hours and what? Can you please get out of my space? I don't really want to look at your bad skin or those, look at those eyelashes. Come on now, those are like awnings. You can put those over these windows right here. Your cheeks have not seen sun in months with those eyelashes on. Who are you? You're not a cop. Let's go, you go, 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 go. Go, go, go. I can go here because I'm a member of the public. Stupid. Look at Barney right here. Look at the clown. Look at the clown. It's probably people trying to bluff me. These people trying to bluff me. I'm going to walk in circles the whole time. You guys trying to bluff me. Tell me I can't walk in here through, the, through a public space. After the bluff on streets has gone up in smoke, he doesn't miss the opportunity to tell the security guard about the big secrets of OT Lever 3. This saves him a lot of money and time. Look at these guys. I can't believe these guys bluff like that. So how does it feel to be a Scientologist security guard, man? This is your life. You gave your whole life to this, to fighting off, I guess, the Galactic Confederacy, huh? Well, so at what level are you at? Are you at OT3 yet? Because if not, I really want to tell you a great story. You heard about Xenu by now from the, <laughs> from the Galactic Confederacy. 70 million years ago, there was an overcrowding of a billion people, so they froze them like popsicles. They brought them to Earth, and they dropped them in a volcano, and dropped an atomic bomb on them. And then the Thetans rose up, and they went and brainwashed them and flung them out. Great story, isn't it? Can you believe you gave your life to that shit? Imagine hearing that story and saying, man, you know what, man? This is, some, this is amazing stuff, man. I give my life to this. That's you. That's you. That's you and your family. You don't feel the least bit silly. You know why? Because you're roped in at this point. You're too invested at this point. The average person will listen to that story and say, well, that's absolutely fucking nuts, but you're too far gone. So now you're saying, you know what? I have no choice. I gave my life to this batshit crazy stuff and I have to continue going. Oh, no, got to speak on the thing. And how come your uniform looks so dusty? They don't give you new, new uniforms. I know for a fact, if you get a new one, you have to pay for it yourself. And you, listen, man, you only got, you only getting paid $47 a week. You're only getting paid $47 a week and that new uniform cost, that's a good chunk of it right there, huh? That's a good chunk of it right there. Go complain to them, I'm gonna go walking through here again because I'm allowed to. You guys are just faking it. Look who's here again, the Osa guy. Someone must know who that is. Don't touch me, don't touch me. 
So there's another guy. What, what level are you? You OT3 yet? I want to talk to you about that. I know personally, I know you're kind of stupid. So I don't know if you even OT3 yet. The LAPD did show up, and, as always, they went to Scientology first, even though Jessica had called. But who knows? Scientology has the direct line to the officers. They probably called, too. And we told you guys we were the callers first, but yet you still go in there. It's a little bit of bias you, you guys have, huh? How the permit says so. She has no right to put her hands on children who are trying to access this public way, which she has a right to be on. Yet she put her hands on it. I call that battery. We have video of it. You need to keep your hands to yourself, lady. You're a grown woman putting your hands on children. And you don't even know the law. Like I said, we can walk through here. You have no right to stop us from walking through here. You don't even know what you're enforcing. I'm not gonna let you get in my way and get physical with me to try to stop my right away. I'm gonna tell you cops, he does that again, he's gonna end up on the ground. He has no right to do that. Learn the law. The permit is not a private event on the sidewalk. The permit says otherwise. Don't you ever put your hands on me or impede my right away, when you, especially on a public space, when you're enforcing something, you don't even know what you're enforcing. You said it's a As always, Scientologists lie and lie and lie, and the LAPD will not intervene and will not execute the PPA for Solomon. Once again, we see selective enforcement by the LAPD in favor of Scientology. No, 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 no. Nobody was disturbing the Nobody's disturbing. We're, we're so, the public. We're allowed to walk through. Yeah. I'm going to continue walking through. They look stupid. Okay, okay good. Opinion. We got that out of the way. That's out of the way. Now what? So what are you going to do about the PPA? Like, I'm not even saying you're disturbing. I don't care what you're saying about it. I don't care what they have to say. I don't care what they have to say. It's all on video. It doesn't matter. I don't want I don't care. I don't. Nobody here can see it. We're allowed to walk through. You don't have, you tell them, you go back there and tell them that we didn't want to hear it. That's what you could tell them. Now, what are you going to do about the PPA? I also wanted to show you the video of her tossing his bike out of the way, too, since she thinks she could grab people's stuff. Well, we'll document everything, but here's what's going to happen. The battery that occurred to show the arrest is unwarranted at this point. Oh, my God. All right, guys, I, guys, I have nothing else to say. Okay, but that, it, that's cool. I'm sure they did say that. I'm not saying they didn't say it, yeah. but that's bullshit because they have to show it. Do not be sitting there shoulder checking us because you don't want to show us. I was coming here for five minutes. I know. I know. And the whole they lied to the like, cops and the cops just took it. Oh, shit. Okay. Timu Barney over there. I'm going to get your name. I'm going to cook you. I'm going to file a complaint with BSIS. You're going to get a BSIS complaint. There is going to be one. Putting your hands on kids. You know what? This is my sidewalk right now. How you feel, Odo? This is my walk, sidewalk. I'm going to take a walk over here. I'm going to have to. They, it's... I'm going to have to mute it for a second. Whose street is this right now? 